originally started because our co-founder, Dylan Whitman, uh, not sure if you heard of him, he previously owned BBXL, uh, at that time, largest Shopify agency. So he was able to, and I'll kind of paint a story around it. He was able to work with a variety of merchants, right, from all sorts of verticals um, and industries in the world of e-commerce, and a consistent problem kept coming up, right? He kept seeing a pattern that retention marketing just took way too many systems to execute. So too many resources, and it was just too complicated to uh, execute eventually, right? So he, he partnered with Brian, who, uh, Brian Levine, who was at that time at Twilio, literally a technical genius, man. Uh, and James Brennan, who's a, another e-commerce veteran, came up with the brand Suja, right? That was sold to Coca-Cola. And they set out to build this platform that would simplify retention marketing so you can accomplish more with less resources. And that's what we all want. Okay. Is that how you would say retention rockets pretty much come about? Like how, uh, you know, how did he really like walk through the steps of, oh, this is how we should kind of build this out? Yeah. So essentially what we're not just designing a kind of single tool that, you know, you throw into your marketing stack and then, you know, off you go and kind of hope you, you know, pray to God that it works. <laughs> what we're building ultimately is going to change the way marketers ultimately talk with their customers right so it's going to work for marketers you know most most tools out there uh, presently you know you need a whole team right and and you need to learn this new technology it's often very complicated right and it's demotivating for everybody and then it kind of just sits there right our platform is designed to be used literally out of a box uh it's simple and allows really complex and complicated marketing campaigns to become you know like elementary school level, easy and simple to execute. So the thing that about us, what makes us different, right? Um, it's that we're designing a product that just works and it's mm -hmm. simple. Yeah. So retention platforms, like when I, when I hear like, okay, retention software, retention, this retention that it, to me, it always sounds like it's a little on the fluffier side and it's kind of yeah. like, okay, like, yeah, it's another retention, you know, platform. Great, blah, blah. Obviously, I'm very familiar with Dylan Whitman's work. I'm very familiar with BBSL's work. Uh, of course, Twilio is an amazing platform as well. So when I saw you guys get together, I was like, okay, good. Maybe someone will make one that's not awful. So what is it really that kind of differentiates you from all the other, like, noise out there of, of this kind of category? Yeah, man, that's a, that's a great question, right? So for anybody listening, right, I, I like to kind of keep it really simple, right? It's, it's three things that I, I think, it's, it's, there's three reasons why people buy anything, right? right? It's either, how is this gonna make me money? How is this gonna save me money? And how is it gonna keep me out of jail, right? Which is compliance. <laughs> so I think like three reasons why, like what's our competitive advantage in the marketplace is that you get immediate ROI out of us, right? There's no like, you know, wait till three months, two months. It's literally install it 24 hours later, you're making money. Mm -hmm. the ease of use, right? You don't need a, a hire a virtual team or you don't need to hire a big time success management team to uh, run this for you, right? You can do it as a, as a merchant owner um, and because it, it's integrated in, in your current technology stack and it's simple, right? So we're, we're taking this really complex technology that Brian and his team built and making it and then delivering it out of the box for you. Um, when it comes to our team, you know, what kind of makes us different, right? And why I think we'll win in the marketplace that's getting, you know, very competitive every day is mm. that we're nimble, right? Our, our product <laughs> updates, um, you know, come as a result of listening to you guys, right? The, the store owners, uh, the merchants, right? You guys tell us what you need and then we build versus, you know, hey, we think this needs to be done. So we'll build it based on our opinions. Yeah. Um, you know, we're super approachable, man. I, I love doing stuff like this. <laughs> and, and we're e-commerce experts, right? I mean, Dylan, as you know, built numerous brands. He, he's, he's led BBA and then, and then obviously James and, and Brian are, are, you know, the tech and the brand experts. Yeah. So, all right. So we know what it does, right? Yeah. So it's a customer retention software. How exactly does it do it? Like what are the actual services, the actual components that, that you know, Retention Rocket has that's different from everything else? Yeah, I mean, <laughs> so it, it's, I mean, I could go into like a 20 minute spiel, right? How it's done, right? But essentially, yeah. <laughs> what, 
we we're building we have an omni channel right a multi channel platform right that that delivers the message at the right time right through the right channel with the right product so you know you go in you're checking out your favorite shoes for whatever reason you abandon the cart right there's a little bit of a snippet code right that's installed on your on your checkout it takes literally like 10 minutes and then we and then you as a merchant are able to pre- send out a predictive message right whether it's 10 minutes or like 3 hours later right with a custom message saying hey you know Andrew if you come back here's the code to to check out it mm-hmm. brings you back you're able to measure um attribution for each conversion right because it's all white labeled um so it's really designed to uh execute outbound ca- sms campaigns and and uh and m- make retention marketing very simple for you So that's where uh that's where Twilio came in with the SMS uh push notifications that's awesome. Exactly. That's good. Okay. Cuz yeah. you know it's interesting we were actually just talking about this the other day about how you know chatbots are are taking over and why they're doing so well now and how they probably won't stay that way. And the the text messaging, you know, the whole SMS thing is it's very interesting cuz I'm curious to see you know if if anything is really cool and it's working great leave it up to us marketers to ruin it after a little while. <laughs> So I am kind of curious like 2 3 years from now when people finally catch on to oh SMS is awesome or you know chatbots are great like how many times is my phone just going to be going off with like notifications of stuff that I signed up for like if you compare your e- it's kind of like email with how many emails you get so I'm interested like I hope I don't get as many text messages as I get emails but I'm I'm curious to see how that's going to sustain over the years. Um, yeah. but if they're perfectly timed obviously which I know Twilio does great that's uh that's obviously something that that will help with that. Yeah, absolutely. I mean just even like our plans for the future and and, and kind of trends we're seeing and and you know like a year even 5 years down the line, right? Is well our plan for the future is obviously to focus and relentlessly serve our customers. Mm-hmm. Um but we believe that you know with just the growth of AI and you know marketing technology is predictive, right? You're not supposed to be getting uh an SMS or a Facebook messenger if you are really annoed by those, right? Yeah. <laughs> you're just throwing something against the wall and hoping shit stay uh you know sticks. <laughs> um <laughs> so we want to be kind of pioneers, right, of running, you know, AI and and and, and predictivity behind um mm-hmm. kind of marketing, right? So I think that, like the way, you know, if we if we're going to talk about trends, right? We're <laughs> we're seeing the tech- we're wanting to see technology platforms that actually work together right so api economy is is constantly growing and and uh and consequences of that is the technology working alongside each other right so uh switching between apps has never been easier i mean 5 years ago that was a, a huge fixed cost right yeah. behind that. uh so right now i mean we're just focusing on marketing tools that should empower marketers right like you mentioned mm-hmm. um and, and technology should not bog you down to do what you really want to do is right serve customers and make more money right yeah nice so i uh i was you know always been a fan of of BVSL's work uh so i know, very much know who Dylan is and uh if there's one thing i always knew about BB excels that they put out great work obviously uh I know MVMT is one of the the big ones that they worked with that a lot of people know that awesome watch company the way that website looks is amazing um but it also is very clear that not everyone can work with BB excel uh you know they are one of the top tier shopify agencies so how do you see is retention rocket going to be kind of similar to that where you know in uh what is your ideal client i guess is kind of what i'm getting at yeah no that's an awesome question so right now we we wanted to um you know when we came out with a product we wanted to um build out a proof of concept right so we kind of heavily focused on on the shopify clients right and specifically shopify plus um you know not, that's not to say we don't work with with regular shopify clients we we actually have quite a few uh but kind of our ideal customer profile if you will right it's, it's it's anybody that's 1 million plus in in um in sales and annual revenue right mm-hmm. um um and it's got to make about you know 300 orders plus a month um that kind of we saw that as a sweet spot right where yeah. conversions are really really high all right but yeah that's a, i mean that's not bad because you got to think like 
retention software doesn't work if you don't have customers to retain. <laughs> exactly. Um, so yeah. you have to have the, the proof of concept before you can do anything. So that's, that makes sense. That's a, yeah. that's a little bit easier. Exactly. Um, For anybody listening, I mean, we're, we're actually coming out. I mean, we're, we're going to be platform agnostic. I don't know if anybody's had a chance to come check out the website, but uh, we're pushing out our, our, like I said, our platform is consistently getting updated. Um, mm -hmm. you know, segmentation is going to be a big thing, push notifications, uh, which is going to be really, really huge. So, and, and yeah, the plan is to be platform agnostic. So like Magento, WooCommerce, on and on and on. Um, nice. Yeah. So what are, um, obviously, you know, you guys are, are a newer platform, so I know a lot of stuff is brand new, but what is, what are the 2019 releases look like? What's down, what's coming down the pipeline that people can go, oh, I should sign in now before they jack up their prices when they release that kind of thing. Oh my God. Yeah, man. Like I, like I just kind of just touched on, right. So like push notifications, uh, be able to segment, uh, customers right into different buckets. Uh, so really just, uh, and literally that's coming in the next week and a half. You're going to be able to, uh, really kind of take advantage of that predictive, uh, technology, right. So being able to send the right message at the right time to a customer, mm -hmm. right. Which, I mean, as, as we know, right, like 97% of SMS messages in, in an e-com um, retail space are opened uh, within three minutes. So we, we're, we're kind of being the pioneers behind that. So, yeah, yeah I mean, a lot of new features. Um, Brian and his team are working diligently kind of behind the scenes to, to get going. But, yeah, segmentation and, and push notifications are kind of the two things that are kind of we're rolling out. Um, you know, Facebook, live chat, Facebook Messenger as well. Uh, so we're kind of giving you a full suite. You don't have to use very, various different tools, right, to do mm -hmm. one thing, right, which is retention marketing. We kind of want to be the full suite of things uh, and kind of use us for, for everything retention marketing. Nice. So I've lately I've just been diving into chatbots a little bit more just to because I can. Uh, and I was curious. <laughs> I was curious, like as you were mentioning, so you can automate sending them SMS messages and all that stuff. Do you know, like, is it possible to set up an SMS message just like a chatbot where if someone texts you and you're like, hey, you have a notification, do you want to use this? Be like, yeah, I do. Like, instead of having to go into the software, can you set up SMS messaging just like chatbots? Yeah, yeah. So it's, it's literally ingrained in our, in our platform. Um, you can That's set awesome. up that campaign. <laughs> yeah, and it, and it kind of triggers it off. I mean, um, I wish... I'm I'm not as Instagram savvy, man. I would show you the, the, how it would look like. But yeah, absolutely. <laughs> it's all right. you, can, uh, you can set that. And then down the line, you know, we'll have Instagram and, and other channels, you know, Snapchat down the line. And uh, so all, all kinds of kind of fun things coming down. Nice. So, you know, beginning of the year, I always get the same themed questions going. So I, I apologize that this, this one's a little repetitive. But I am curious as to your guys' thoughts, what do you think – is going to change in the market over the next, at least the next year. Yeah, no, I mean, you're, you're gonna, you're gonna start seeing, like I said, um, you're gonna start seeing uh, marketing technology really kind of evolving and, mm -hmm. and AI is going to be a big part, right? Predictive marketers are, or sorry, customers are going to want to see, you know, I'm going to be have to, I'm going to have to be targeted properly. Right. There's not going to be any more like, okay, I'm going to send out an email and hoping it converts. Uh, right. right. Because they're just, they, there's just various different channels right now. Right. With SMS and Facebook and, and, and email. And so it's, you're going to want predictive technology right now. And, um, and, and, and it, it, as far as for marketing, I mean, it's just going to be a stack that, needs to be working together alongside each other and uh and technology needs to be be able to be used properly and easy right um out of the box um not a large team to execute so those are kind of some of the trends we're seeing um yeah so ai is going to be a big part nice look i love to keep these you know short and sweet and fun and not not eat up too much of your friday so you know we can uh we can call it a day but i really appreciate you doing this with us um, and plus, I don't want to give everyone too much fun. You got They got to go to the site and check it out. So, uh, but really appreciate it. Thank you so much for doing this with us. Everyone who watches this, feel free to message us uh, any questions you may have, um, either of us. This will go up on our YouTube and on our blog too, so you guys can have access to it then. We'll link over to retention in case you guys want to find them as well. Absolutely. Um, but I would love to have uh, some uh, uh, closing remarks just to let everyone know how they can find uh, Retention Rocket. 
Yeah, absolutely. Well, first of all, thank you. And, and thanks to the Sellers uh, Choice to, to host us today. Uh, I had a really good time kind of chatting it, chopping up the, um, yeah. chopping it up with you. Uh, if you'd like to learn more, you know, please go to retentionrocket.com. We're actually um, having a, a pilot program that you can join for, you know, 10 days or two weeks if you want for free, really. Um, somebody could give you their product, uh, product tour or, uh, or, you know, a free trial that you'd like to kind of take advantage and, and start making money instantly. Um, but otherwise, yeah, look out for more content and, 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 um, and just kind of seeing us for the ride. Nice. Appreciate it, buddy. Thank you so much. I will talk to you soon and enjoy your Friday. Thanks so much again. Take care. Have a good weekend. Have a good one. Bye.